everybody welcome back to my channel um so if you saw on my instagram i had several polls on there um and it was my makeup picking up my makeup so um that's what we're gonna do today um i literally got out every product except for primer what the heck Helena? okay so the primer that one was the milk makeup um Hydro Grip Primer. So, we're just going to put this. This is a really good primer. I use it all the time. My skin is clean because I just took a shower and I washed my skin in the shower. Looking nice, looking nice, looking nice. So, the next product that won was the revolution conceal and define foundation and this is in shade f3 i use this all the time so it's a fave so what we're gonna do i'm just gonna take it and i'll just spread it out first and then i'll blend it in with my sponge i'm getting a little low And the concealer that one is the Urban Decay All Nighter Concealer. I've only used that, um, I think one time actually. I think it's like a really drying formula, so we're gonna have to um, like do one section and then blend it out and then do another one because it's a pretty good drying consistency. It's a very full coverage though. I'm gonna go ahead and blend this out because if I get it in right, it's gonna like like it really dries down like to a mat. So I want to go ahead and blend it out before it dries and we can't blend it out. But it's a very nice coverage. Okay, the next product I'm gonna use, I didn't let you guys do this because I really only only have like one face powder that I really use. It is the Maybelline Fit Me Powder, so I'm going to go ahead and set my face. And then we will come back for bronzer. Okay, so my face is still going to set with the powder on it and everything. And this is also kind of... But the bronzer that you guys picked is the Park Avenue Princess Bronzer from Tarte. This does have a little bit of shimmer in it, but it's a pretty forgiving bronzer. Just hit pan. And then we're gonna do blush, and the blush that you guys chose was the Tarte Blush, I chose a lot, like literally a lot of Tarte products, but you chose the Tarte Blush in Harmony. It's just a peach blush. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I always forget to look at the camera. My head. Okay, let me look at the camera. See, it's so hard. Okay, so now we're gonna dust off the fake. Okay, and then I'm going to spray my face with the Tarte Saints Rays, which you guys chose. Just to give my face some, like, no moisture back. Okay, and then the highlighter that you guys chose was the Ofra Nikki Tutorials collab. And glazed on it, so we're just gonna pop out on the cheeks.
I can taste the setting spray. But we're gonna go ahead, or I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows off camera because I didn't have you guys choose anything for that because I don't only have one thing. So I'm gonna do my brows off camera and we'll be back to finish off the rest of the face. Hey guys, I just forgot to put my brow gel on. We're gonna do brow gel on camera then because. Holy okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and do lips and the lip that y'all chose was the Anastasia Liquid Lip in Naked. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. So the palette y'all chose is the Morphe palettes that I own, so the Jaclyn Hill and the James Charles palette, but I feel like I use the James Charles palette like way too much. So, um, we're going to use the Jaclyn Hill palette. Just put some brown gel on my brows because I forgot to do that. Because there was a spider and I had to kill it. Because there's no spiders in my makeup tutorial, so that's what's up. So this is, if you haven't seen it, this is what the palette looks like. Um, I'm just going to do like a neutral eye. I don't want to do anything crazy today. So first I'm going to take off this like mustard color right here. Take that color. And this light color right here, the yellow. And we're just going to mix those together and pop this in the crease. Oh, and this is the Morphe M573 brush. I'm gonna go ahead and pop those two colors in the lower lash line as well, and then we're gonna move on. Okay, so next what we're gonna do is we're gonna use, I'm gonna use this warm brown right here, so this one right here. Like a terracotta kind of color. Just pack that on to outer edges on the lower lash line as well then I'm gonna go back in with my first yellow color and we're just gonna blend out the edges really lightly Then we're going to go in with this dark burgundy color right here and just keeping that right in this area. Just right there. And then I'm going to go back and with that warm color right here, this one, with a little bit of the first color. I'm going to make sure everything's nice and blended out. Like so. Maybe we'll go close. I'm going to take this clean Morphe brush. This is the M562. And I'm just going to take that first yellow shade and just run that right here. Just kind of blend everything out right there. Make sure everything's nice and seamless. I'm just taking that yellow shade, blending everything out right there. Okay. Make sure the inner corner is clean. And then I'm going to take this shade right here. Go ahead and, actually no I'm not. I'm going to go ahead and carve the crease just a little bit. Um, just like a half cut crease. And we're going to put some glitter because glitter was also one of the things that you guys wanted to see. We're also going to be using the Too Faced DM Girl Mascara. And 
Okay, I'm just gonna take this glitter right here. It's like a, mm, it's like a dark gold. It's like really pretty. It's really fall vibes. So I'm gonna do that once I can find some concealer. I'm gonna take just a little bit of concealer right there. I'm gonna take this flat brush. was not enough right here is just boom that should be enough I'm gonna have to go find my lash glue because I have no clue where it is. So give me a sec. Okay. So I found the lash glue. All I did was um, go ahead and add bottom mascara, add a little bit of gloss. Just because my lips were kind of looking a little dry. So I'm just gonna add some lash glue right where I'm gonna put the glitter. Let that dry for a minute. We're gonna do is we're gonna dip into that glitter and I'm just gonna put it right there. Get all the glitter out of my lashes. a lot and I'm gonna go back in with my Jaclyn Hill palette just to kind of clean everything up a little bit just like right here make sure everything's nice and blended section then I'm gonna go in with that then I'm gonna highlight color and just pop it in there A little bit on the brow bone. Just a little bit. And then I'm going to go ahead and do a mascara. So I'm just going to take the Too Faced Damn Girl Mascara. Pop that on my lashes. Just a little bit because we are going on with falsies. And I'm going to do those off camera so I'll be back with the finished look. Okay, here is the finished look. Got a little glitter. My head looks weird, but okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Okay guys, have a great day.